in this video. I find more paper, and then I made a teapot from hell. And come across a mysteriously locked door. So, let's begin. 16th of May, 1839. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. British North? Am I an archaeologist or something? Like, I, I dig things for money. I'm like a sort of excavator where you build buildings, but for science and history. I should have installed better bookcases. Okay. What's this? In the fireplace. Can you not like this? Oh. Oh. Come on, webs are flammable. Flim. I mean, I don't know what the word is. Ow! Okay, um, so nothing else useful in this one. That's ah, really dark over there. I don't think I'm gonna go over there. Oh, I'm so much better at opening and closing doors now, and something keeps moving around. Damn it! <sighs> that was too loud. In the cylinder. Oh. 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 Light it. Oh, it feels so nice. I'm pretty sure I should turn down the brightness. This is a little bit too bright. Can I do that? Yeah, it's on one. I had 0.8 before. There we go. It's much darker. It's more atmospheric. I guess you'd move this bit closer to me. Oh, there we go. I offer my full attention and services. I thought I had the lip sync, that one had obviously not. I hereby offer my full attention and services to Alexander Baron of Brennerdorf. Is this a rent boy? What the f. Is this some sort of prostitute? So, ready for a total. My frame show return. Oh. Alexander's into some weird shit. Prussian Royal Court. Oh. I must be pretty good at it. May no man break the seal. Wilhelm. It's not a guy's name. It's not a guy's name. Um, was that it? It makes it all pretty because I lit it up with a key. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Holy shit, isn't it really dark down there? What the fuck keeps moving around? Oh, I don't like this. This. The archives. Can I go back? What? Something moved in here. Can I go back to the old archive? What? Fuck? What the fuck, man? Is there something out there? Whatever. Just pick up. 17th of May, 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I oh, mustered my strength that's not and very yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage 
confused me. Oh, it it's looked so much confusing. older than the fourth century structure we had oh, expected. In that context. The twisting path emerged into a great, great antechamber. Nope. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. I was trapped. Fucking hell. Suspenseful diary entry, man. What happens to him? I gotta get the next page and know what happens to him. I was trapped. And then there was this massive party going on. And I woke up in some random castle. Wait. That's what's happening right now. Am I repeating the past? Oh, this door is open. Was this door open before? What the fu- Oh, shit. The candle fucking scared the shit out of me. London. Uh, turn this on. Oh, that's be cute. Oh, fuck! Oh, is that like some sort of oh fucking scary teapots and shit? Fucking hell, they're out to get me. Oh my god! What is that a piano? What the fuck, man? I myself in. Oh, this is weird shit. I don't want to do this anymore. It's not. A, it's, it's probably some sort of. It's cocaine and tinder box, like someone's drug stash or something. Oh fuck! I have to go outside. Bet I'm assuming going to be behind this door. And it's just going to jump out. And f Ooh, chest. I have the worst attention span. <gasps> awesome. Okay, so me. <laughs> oh fuck! I don't want to open this door, man. What the fuck keeps moving around? What the fuck is that shit? Hello, Peter. Peter, I'm sorry. But I prefer Gale. Oh my god. Wrong ga game. Oh my god. That is way too violent. It, was, it won't open. It's locked. Damn it. My first locked door. Fuck. In the next episode! Bloody rocks. Oh my god. And I trip balls. Find a mysterious room behind the mysteriously locked door. In which a mysterious bookcase was hiding a mysterious secret room. Which also contained a mysterious key and a mysterious note. Shit gets real. It's oh, what the fuck? So, yeah, subscribe so you can watch all that boring shit. Okay, cool, bye.